Welcome again to the Chancellor's Video Blog. I'm Dr. Bruce Leslie, Chancellor of the Alamo Colleges, and I'm standing in front of the Alamo Colleges San Antonio College Nursing and Allied Health Building. This complex was constructed as a result of a bond election that was held about, about 12 years ago, and it has been a wonderful facility for our nursing and allied health programs. But I'm standing here because uh, we've just been notified by Standard & Poor's and Moody's that uh, First Standard & Poor's has increased its rating of us to AAA. That's the highest rating that any organization can receive from the bonding organization. And Moody's has reaffirmed their already AAA rating. So we are the only institution that I'm aware of, particularly in higher education, that has two AAA ratings from both of these primary uh, rating agencies. And of course, what this means to the taxpayers it reduces the cost of money that we borrow in bonds that we use, of course, for refurbishing and maintaining our campuses and our facilities and in the construction of new facilities, et cetera. So this is a real milestone for us. And both Standard & Poor's and Moody's commented that because of our outstanding, strong, and um, well-organized uh, financial uh, structure that uh, we deserve this very high rating. So we're, we have a well-embedded and sustainable program. We've got a wonderful uh, team led by Diane Snyder and uh, Pamela Ansbury and Tracy Bidwell and their uh, team members uh, that have resulted in a whole series of formal steps that they have taken over the years to really elevate the financial strength and stability of the uh, Alamo Colleges. So we're very, very proud uh, of this uh, momentous occasion. Uh, I'd also like to share with you that at the San Antonio commencement uh, last week, uh, trustee and now former chair, Ana Bustamante, received a reverse transfer degree from San Antonio College. She had attended SAC some years ago, had achieved uh, basically enough credits uh, for her to earn the associate degree, but then transferred to uh, A&M Kingsville and uh, received her baccalaureate there and also went on for a master's degree. But we have a program called Reverse Transfer, which is becoming uh, an increasingly important part of uh, degree awards that we make to students uh, who have since transferred to a, a university. And uh, what we do is transfer back the university credits to complete the 60-hour degree for the associate degree. And so at the commencement, we extended to Ms. Bustamante this award. Uh, the other good news is uh, Anna was just re-elected uh, for her second term uh, as trustee, and the board uh, voted uh, the other night to um, complete her two-year term, which is the normal term for officers of the board, and to elect uh, Dr. Yvonne Katz as the new chair. So thanks, Anna, and congratulations. Uh, we're also very pleased that we have the largest study abroad program in the history of the Alamo Colleges. We have uh, 30 students who this summer will be traveling to China, Japan, London, Spain, Italy, and South Korea. And the majority of these students, about three quarters of them, are receiving scholarships either from the Benjamin Gilman Scholarship Program or from the uh, foundation, the Alma Colleges Foundation Program, that allows them to be able to offset their costs. They are taking formal courses, so not only are they learning about the language and the culture of the countries and cities they'll be visiting, but they're also building teamwork and they're carrying out their academic pursuits as well. So it's a phenomenal program and we're very proud to have such a large group of students and faculty that are uh, traveling. So it's, I said 30, I meant 54 students actually, and 13 faculty members will be traveling to these countries uh, this summer. Thanks again for joining uh, the Chancellor's Video Blog. I look forward to talking to you next week.